here. <gasps> no! Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode from my survival series. This time, we're going to go into the nether straight away because we haven't died in the nether and I never went to the nether after that. But yeah, real minecrafters don't be scared. They go back to fi face their fears. Wow, okay. So, we will be going into the nether to show those magma cubes who is boss. So, I'm going to spawn proof the place. That means I'll place buttons or slabs so that they don't, uh, the magma cubes don't spawn. <coughs> so, I'm, we cook, I'm cooking up some stone here because we need the buttons uh, to spawn proof it. And then I'll also collect some black stone so that I can make some black stone slabs. And that will work very well to spawn proof as well. Yep, I got 34 buttons only. The whole tunnel needs to be spawn proofed. I will need so much cobblestone to smell down into stone. This is going to take a lot of stuff, but nether is really useful. It's like uh, we need to get blaze rods or else we cannot cure that zombie villager over there. And if someone suggested uh, me to make a food farm with animals, I mean, I watched the video, they recommended a video, I watched it. It's a chicken farm, I will make it. I'm not sure if I'll do it in this episode. Yeah, I'm going to spawn proof the nether and if I, I'll go mining and if I have time I'll just make the farm, that farm. So, let's just, yeah, dude guys don't need to see it. I'll cut and I'll be back when we are So back. guys, while the stone is cooking out, I was just enchanting some of the stuff, like I enchanted all my diamond stuff, so that I can fight away the magma cubes. Like, this is going to be very difficult. Like the nether scares me because the 1.16 is just tough. Like I went there very uh, happily and casually because I play on a ser Minecraft server and I have a lighter and stuff in there, so I'm not scared to go in the nether. So like in this world, I'm pretty scared. I'm just waiting up for the stone to go. This is taking a lot of time. Because I, I don't want to go into the nether, I'll be out of blocks and come back. That's a bad idea. So I want to cook up stone and then do that. I mean, I can make wooden buttons, but that will not work that well. And stone buttons also won't work with the basalt we have there. But yeah, we have no choice. I cannot use black stone because that's a lot of black stone. Just, is there black stone buttons even in the game? I'm not sure. Oh, what? How did that even happen? I'll have to check the recording. I didn't do that. I mean, now that we have made that... Oh, I'm so bad at redstone. Actually, I'm really good at... Okay. That's useful. What will you use these two for? I mean... Yeah. We can use that to fawn proof, but... That hides the bus out a lot more, the block underneath it, and... It takes two stone to make one of those. I don't want to go with slabs because slabs don't look that good. Now I have to AFK here until the stone picks up. So I'm going to see you when we are in the nether. So guys, as I told that I'll go into the nether and then I'll cut out. But um, the stone is just taking too long to cook up. I'm cooking the stone and it's taking too long. So I think... I'm going to bring two chickens here to make that farm. I will leave that uh, video in the description. It's a very good video. It shows how to make a chicken farm. Uh, go and watch that video right now. So... Okay, let's bring two chickens here and trap them. I have to first make a place to trap them. Like I made for this zombie blazer. So let's make a hole. I mean, is it that tough? This is enough for now. Is it really enough? I guess so. I mean, if I think that's enough, then it is enough. Where are the chickens? I need cows as well. I will also make a cow farm. 
yeah, I know a cow farm. I haven't watched a video on YouTube for a cow farm. I don't need to watch a video. Like I knew how to make a chicken farm. I, you know, I watched a video just to know a little bit better. That's a good way to make farms. Go to YouTube, type the farm, you will get it. Hmm, so where are chickens? I think I will have to go to the plains biome. Yep. Like my food situation need to be sorted and cooked chickens is always good. I love I like chicken in real life so chicken. So I will have to find Oh this is the place where we take up sand. That is in the middle of sand time lapse. Nobody saw it. We also need to find a desert because I cannot keep on destroying the sand here. Because like it just looks bad without any sand. So I will need to go to a desert and get sand. Because concrete is very useful. I don't see any chickens. Last time I am not going to break a pumpkin. Last time when I broke a pumpkin, it started raining. The pumpkins are staying there. Mm. I don't see any chicken. Oh, we are nearing the base. I just check my recording like I just uh, went out of minecraft to see how it is and I seems like it was laggy when I was walking from there to here I don't know if it is still laggy yeah. I cannot do anything for the lag I don't have a good computer so I cannot I cannot play the mod packs like pixel mod there's a lot of mod packs that I want to play uh, it does not even work uh, without recording how will I even record it when I get a better computer I will record a lot of stuff. So guys, this is the village that I talked about in that episode. See, that's how the village that we went to first episode and this is like the village that I went to. I think third episode or second. The thing that happened, I said, I went into the nether, came out, I did not like check my recording or anything. And it was so laggy, I couldn't put it in the video. But yeah, I don't know if it is lagging right now. I'll put it in the video anyways. As you can see, it's just a village. So I don't need to put it in the video. Like, I have explored it completely. We have two villages here. Okay, one chicken. We need at least two. So that we can get infinite. Okay, our base all the way over there. This is going, just going to take a few hours. So I'll have to cut here. Oh. So guys, we just got two chickens. Like, one chicken just came out of nowhere. I mean, these chickens took a lot of time to find, like, I had to cross the river, and it took so much time. Man. Chickens are, oh, I just changed the food in my inventory, like, they are following me because of the seeds, I put it in my off hand, because if I accidentally press the scroll button and change the item in my hand, then they will stop coming with me for some time. So I got the seeds in the other hand. This other hand thing is useful, like two hands. That makes a lot of sense. We have two hands, we should be able to use them. It's mainly for the shield. Man, I don't want to eat this bread. Why is there no butter in Minecraft? You know, we got milk in Minecraft, we can get from, from cows. But we cannot, the only thing we can do with the milk is that it will remove all our uh, debuffs, like bad. It just removes all our potion effects. And so that's just, uh, it does not even uh, get to some hunger. I think we should be able to make butter. So that I can put that into the bread and that will taste much better. Or we need something like sandwich. That will be good. But yeah, just regular bread, no. Or else I will just put golden carrots. Like carrots made out of gold. Can you imagine? Okay, so we are here. Mm, okay, so we are finally here. That took a lot of time. I now regret this. So, make them fall down. Come on, chickens. Okay, they are smarter than everyone thinks. Fall down. Nice. Where's the other chicken? Listen. Chick. Listen. Listen. Seeds and like 
like this is annoying already like if you think this is annoying while watching the video you should go and try out some villages then you will never ever try them out <laughs> you might just try them out because they are super good like if you do it once then you have to do it every time if you are playing survival because villages are just too useful they give so much stuff but they are so annoying so I have to first make a bit of chickens like the farm does not work like this oh wow I want to make the farm building some like building here I think I have to also make a building for the nether portal that will be done in next episode I think so I think I'm going to head into the nether and I'm going to see if it is lagging because it might be so let's go into the nether and I'll just check if it's lagging and stuff. I'll just kill up all the magma cubes that's there. And then I'll just and I don't think there was any lag. I don't think there is any lag. I hope so. There does not seem to be lag, I'm checking the footage. So I'm gonna just gonna place it on these buttons. And then oh, that's I think the wrong place. I want the slabs to be in the middle. I'm not sure. Yeah, I don't want the buttons to be like in the middle. This ruins the view. I think I can make it in the sides. And there's like seven, uh, two magma cubes here that I killed. This place is pretty safe now, but they're spawning. They will spawn here, that's the problem. But yeah, I can fight this small part. But yeah, the whole tunnel, I cannot have magma cubes. So guys, I'm already out of buttons. And that did not take any time to place, but it took a lot of time to make the buttons. Like, I think I'm just going to collect this black stone right here, and then make black stone slabs and place this. I mean, it does look, uh, it just ruins it a tiny bit, these buttons. You know what? That doesn't ruin it that much. Let's get this black stone. It's bad that I cannot instrument black stone. I can instrument black stone on my server. Like, that's how my server works. Yeah, like, this is just boring. What's from mining one? Blackstone slabs. I want this roof to be full blackstone. Where did you spawn? Can you jump down? No. Hey, they cannot die in lava, so I did not murder anyone. Don't worry. Oh, I want to collect the bus out that I break. I cannot get it. I'm wasting blocks. Why am I not picking it up? Oh, I'm now picking it up. Magic. Man, I'm wasting so much. Yeah, I have a lot. It feels bad wasting this. Okay, here we have blocks. On here we- <gasps> No! Guys. What do I do? What do I do? I'm dead. So, yeah, we calm on buddy. Everything is right. There's nothing wrong. Everything is going to be all right. It's also started raining. I can't believe this. Why am I not more careful? I lost all the blackstone, I guess. I'm pretty sad about that. Had and sands on my armor and stuff. Nice, I guess. 
I don't have a diamond pickaxe now. It's also thought of raiding. Like the weather knows how sad I am. <sighs> Thing what I'm going to do is now that I don't have any like I don't have two diamonds left. I think I'm going to go mining so I can get more because I have to recover from that I have to recover from that it's going to take a long time to recover I'll have to do it it's also started thundering dude like the weather knows weather knows Man, going outside in this weather feels bad, but yeah, I want to go in the dark, that's better. Man, I still can't believe that. I was like so out of reaction, I just felt out, I was like, oh guys, no! And then I paused, and st was quiet for some time, I was like, should I go to peaceful mode? No, that will still kill me. Should I uh, turn on cheats, but I cannot type cheats? Like, nothing was working, and I was like, no, I'm not going to type cheats, wow. Okay, I said I'm not going to type cheats. There's one cheat I have to type. Okay, it's not a cheat that will give me infinite diamonds. It's not a cheat that will uh, uh, make me OP. It's a cheat. It's not even cheats. Like it's a command. That's all. It is a game rule. Right now it's thundering. So think if what ha happened if that thunder hits my house. My house will burn down to ashes so yeah I'm going to wait I'm gonna turn on cheats I'm not going to cheat anything else this is the only time I'm doing this I want to do game rule random text speed no no do fire tick false what this will do is now if a fire uh, is placed somewhere it will not go off the f so the fire won't uh, get away how would i show this i cannot i need flint yes okay so what i wanted to say is okay so this is flint and steel now now that the fire tick is off this fire will never go it will stay here but the good thing is if i place this fire will not spread as you can see it's thundering so my every like the forest fire has a chance see but the fire will not go and the wood will not burn so that's something that's very useful and should be done but I, I, I didn't also bring any food with me man everything is bad it's thundering like I cannot believe that that was perfect time. So, I have a great idea. What if I just clear all of this area and make like a huge, uh, like, little base thing underground? So, I need to mine the air that torches. Like, all of these mining will go. I need cobblestone anyway. Like this, I think that's a good idea. But mostly, when pe people do this, they do it with a haste to beacon so that I can ins they can instantly mine the stone the problem here is I don't have a beacon so this is going to be taking a lot of time I, I even have just an iron pickaxe how many hours is this going to take I'm not going to mine it out fully today I'll just like this is another way of mining like I can get diamonds like this as well so I'm gonna cut here and I'm gonna come back and I've made like an hour worth of progress so let's go Now, we have a very small area cut out. Wow. That took a lot more time than you think. Like the iron figure is just too slow. It's like, you might think that this is huge, but yeah, this is really small because I play on a server with Insta mine, like instant mine always. Only stop because I think my pickaxe broke. <laughs> I don't have any food. I cannot run. Reaching home will be tough. 
Everything's going bad. So guys, up we go. This is bad. Look at the stars in the sky. That looks actually very beautiful. Like Minecraft looks so good. The moon is rising. How beautiful house is there. This is awesome. I cannot wait to reach my house. If a skeleton shoots me, I will die. I hear a baby zombie and if you have been playing Minecraft for at least a few days you will know that meeting a baby zombie is one of the worst things especially when you cannot run shut that off sleep baby zombies are just way too dangerous They're not, I don't think they're as dangerous as trying to swim in lava. Have to make some more bread again. I'll have to make that wheat farm, I mean that chicken farm soon. I'll definitely have to. Let's eat the bread. Yeah, I will also have the video link in the description. I, th I think I said that. Go check that video. So I think uh, if I remember correctly... First, I need to get a lot of chickens. I cannot do this much chickens. I need to get a lot of chickens. I need a lot of eggs. Yep. That's another chicken. Okay. I think I have to think of a location to make this farm. I don't know where I'll make it. I think I'll make it near the nether portal. Like the nether portal will not be there forever. It might be. I'm not sure. Like I'm not sure about anything right now. Because I just died. After you die you will feel like not playing anymore. I cannot do that because I am recording. You cannot just see me like jumping out of my chair. Stopping Minecraft. That won't happen. Okay, four hoppers, I think that's how much it needed. Okay, I also need a chest, I think, for the chicken. Okay. Yeah, if you, you will understand what I'm doing if you watch the video. So watch it. And yeah, fire tick is off. This won't burn my house. See? This is so useful. Like, if I accidentally set my house on fire, like, it won't burn it. Like, that should be, uh, it, uh, that's a very good useful game rule to have. So let's make this farm. Need a slab. That's a very nice farm design. I mean, it is a very old farm design that I know about. And even if I know about, I watch the video, so but it's the. So let's just waste these. I need a dispenser. Where's my... Oh yeah, I don't have any pickaxe. <laughs> I have no tools. Finally, got a pickaxe. Yeah, can I please get a dispenser? Can I get a bow? I need a bow for a dispenser. I can make one. And that's a bow. And this will be a dispenser. Don't worry, I'll also make a bow for myself. A enchanted super ultimate power bow. That's going to be awesome. So, dispenser. 
think we need a hopper here. This is where the uh, chickens will go that we have there. Like all the chickens, so what this farm will do, I have to explain this even though this is not my design. The farm will take uh, eggs from the chickens that will be here and it will sh put them into this dispenser and it will shoot them out. There will be lava at the top so when they, they will be this half block when they are small and when they grow up they will hit the lava and give their cooked chicken. That's how the farm works. The whole farm works like that. So let's get some glass, light ray glass because I'm fancy. And here we go. And that works. So what else do I need? I needed. I mean, can I get up this one? Okay. Yeah, I need the chickens. Yeah, it's lava, lava, lava. That's what I was thinking about. Lava. I need to make a bucket. I need to get lava. So I need to go down to the mines again. Not that cool actually. I have to finish up this mountain but I don't have enough dirt. I had a double chest full and it's all over. I'm extending the mountain. Where am I going? I need to place the lava. Okay, this is the scary part where we place the lava. Let's close that up. So this is literally like the whole farm. Like I need, I have to place the redstone system which turns on the dispenser. I think I'm not going to do the same design from the video for that. Yes, I, I know redstone. So it will be kind of similar actually. So I need to take, uh, I need to find out when this dispenser has an item in it and I need to dispense that. So let's actually get a comparator for that. And if you repeat us, and comment out if you want to see the video, if it's a redstone, like I have a video ready for it, I will record it anyway, and I will put it in YouTube. After this, it's going to be a different video, and if I reach 20 subscribers, then I will play another game other than Minecraft. I won't tell you which, I will play another game other than Minecraft. If, uh, okay, you know what? I need to I need to reach 20 subscribers. Now what I'm going to make it a little bit more sweet. And it's going to be if I reach 10 subscribers, I'll make another game video in my channel other than Minecraft. That's a promise. So let's do some redstone from here. can probably do the same thing that guy did in the video. 